I just woke up. It's like 9.30 in the morning. Ich hat Uber schlafen. Yeah. yeah. And I think I slept pretty well. Bern said he slept on a root. And so we're gonna pack our stuff up. We have 30 kilometer nach Serbia. Yeah. In the near. So that's the plan today. Cross into Serbia and go to a campground, hopefully tonight, where we can take showers. Baron's way up ahead of me here. I can't, I can't keep up with him. He's too fast. It's like 10 in the morning. I'm a zombie at this time of day. Baron's flying up the hill up ahead of me. Oh man. I don't really get into my stride until like 1, 2 p.m. Then I'm okay. Anything before noon, I'm toast. trying to tell me something, but I, he doesn't know the word, <laughs> so we're looking him up on the computer. Baron ate a bowl of pasta, and he wasn't hungry, wasn't full, so now he got a salad. Uh, and then we're gonna get ice cream and cake afterwards. <laughs> Baron only got zwei Kugel. He got drei Kugel und Kuchen. Kuchen, <laughs> yeah. inside the bank right now trying to change his money from Romanian lei to Serbian dinar. Um, we'll see what happens. We're having trouble finding a place that'll exchange our money. That's the look of defeat on his face. Uh, yeah, there's another bank. That's the Danube River on our left and Serbia on the other side. We're about to cross the border. And it smells like rotten eggs right now. We just crossed out of Romania. I was in the country for 87 days, the border patrol man said. He said, I can't come back. I only have three days left. But uh, I told him I wouldn't be back. So, Serbia, next. Hi. So we just made it through the border and Baron spotted the uh, Eurovelo signs for the bicycles, the Radvig signs. Radvig? Yeah. The bicycle signs. So the sign says it's 12.6 kilometers to the town where we're going to camp tonight. So not too far. It's really hot right now and both of us have to go to the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> Crossed over into Serbia and we're following the Danube uh, Eurovelo Route 6. We're gonna take that all the way up to Belgrade and I think that's where Baron and I will separate. Uh, 
our first Serbian town. We're trying to find an ATM machine and hoping that they have one here somewhere. Supermarket. And we're hoping that we can buy something there. We only, we each have euros, so we're hoping that'll work. And then maybe they'll give us some Serbian money as an exchange. We just got out of the store. I paid the 20 euros, and this is what I got back in Serbian dinar. Bicycle camping. We made it. Oh God, Mensch, ich will das sehen, was du nachher machst. Dusche auch. Dusche wie? Ja. Dusche wie? Master. Water. Ja, okay. Restaurant. Restaurant. Fisch, Chirapici, Pieskevice, Reschlice. Okay. Schlivo, Vizza. Pivo, Pivo. Okay, wir sehen. So it's time for your interview today. Was denkst du auf Romania? What do you think of Romania? Romania kann man hassen oder lieben. Entweder man liebt es wegen seiner Berge oder man hasst es wegen seiner Straßen. <lacht> <lacht> ich denke, ich liebe es wegen seiner Berge. Ja. Und äh, ich habe gute Erfahrungen gemacht mit den Menschen. Hilfsbereit, offen. Ja. War gut. Waterproof inside and out. Here's our campsite on the edge of the Danube River. Totally free campsite, which is nice. There's a little restaurant over there. This place has like no facilities. There's a shower, it's just a pipe, basically a hose. And the toilets are like a hole in the ground, but hey, it's free. <laughs> 